hey guys good afternoon good morning good evening depending on the time you are seeing this video you are welcome thank you for tuning in thank you for always coming back my name is rosemary and my channel is nceva rose amazing subscribers i appreciate you guys already know i love you from the depth of my heart guys i have like i've said it before i'm turning to a rapper that want to do my intro like hi so guys if you're joining us for the first time you are welcome in this family i make video around relationship marriage and motherhood thank you for your support thank you for clicking to watch do well to click that subscribe button turn the notification bell on so that you'll be notified anytime i upload a new video okay yeah guys today we are going to be continuing what we started okay i made a video about delay in marriage like and i promise you guys i'm going to give you the details of those things that cause delay in marriage and maybe possible solution of what we can do to avert that problem okay so i know you are interested and i know you want to know can relax while we dive into the video You know, you see a lot of people like eligible and ready to get married, but you might be wondering, like, causing the delay. Why is this person not getting married? What, 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 what? You can be asking from a place of genuine interest, like, this person ought to have been married, but what is the problem? That's why I want to come out here and share with you guys some things that causes delay in marriage, okay? First and foremost, the first thing that causes delay in marriage is financial hardship like finance has crippled a lot of people's dream in getting married early and i know a lot of people that have said okay when i get to so 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 and so age i'll get married but getting to that age they find out that they are not even financially buoyant enough to cater for themselves let alone bringing another person in their life and finance alone is equally one of the reasons why people will stay in a long courtship because the money to execute the project is not there. So, so what I want to advise on this thing now, if you have no money, you have no business with marriage, yes, because believe it or not, majority of the problems that, 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 that people experience in marriage has to do with finance, like majority, majority, okay? So if you have no money, you have no business with marriage. I suggest that you go, you pray to God, believing and trusting God that you that you open financial doors and bless you but go and work hard like it is job before ro romance okay go and work hard okay even in the bible you get to see book of job that is job before you get to the book of romance that is romance okay so get something doing and i believe god will help you another thing that causes delay in marriage is indecision like some people cannot decide what they want maybe because they have so many guys or so many girls that are lining up that they are promising marriage and it's making them now not to be decisive enough for to say okay this is who i want some people now tell you okay i like okoro he's tall dark and handsome but i like uh, okay okay he's rich in, and he's slim i know that you some cannot like sit down and make proper decision on what they actually want in life and but whether they like it or not is causing delay in in their marital life okay. Some people find it difficult to decide when it comes to the choice of a life partner. Some don't even know if they want to marry or if they don't want to marry. Some are seeing it like, okay, I have to cater for my younger ones first before I finally settle down, okay? Taking care of your younger one is not bad in any way. But doing that to the detriment of your own future is not wisdom. Another thing under this indecision now is, okay, some people, their one is the problem of getting Mr. Right or Mrs. Right. Okay, that person in the left, can you drag her to the right? I'm just kidding and another people now maybe the celebrities are not that it could be uh finding somebody that love them genuinely for who they are and not for their money or their fame and all that this thing now is causing delay in marriage then if you ask me okay what are you going to do about it like what is what are the solutions that you can possibly offer to somebody that finds his or herself in such a mess listening and listening good up. what i would tell that person is just know that nobody is perfect like we are all working towards perfection and that nobody is going to make a choice of who to marry for you so you have to sit down and decide what you want and work towards it like make a plan be purposeful and work towards that proposal take a bold step and remember that those that do not step out of the boat do not get to walk in the water so take a bold step and believe and trust god to direct your step okay I believe you are getting value hit that like button for me okay it helps me a lot to know the kind of content you guys like okay if you've not subscribed to my channel please i beg in the name of god kindly hit that subscribe button turn the bell also that you don't miss any videos okay another thing that causes my to delay is betrayal like people must have been betrayed by the person they want to marry like betrayal of any sort as in regard to relationship and before they even 
gather themselves together to pick up their life and start afresh like time has passed okay we understand that some people fall into this category they do not wish to like marry late because they they, they were delayed or something pick up yourself and tell yourself this thing that when something bad happened it is left for you to either let it define you let it destroy you or let it strengthen you so i'm here telling you now that whatever must have happened like whatever delay must have happened do not allow it to destroy and define you just let it strengthen you let it give you an edge so that you become better you improve on yourself and work towards getting another relationship or getting ahead in your life okay then another thing guys hmm, another thing that made a lot of people not to get married as that when you is immaturity immaturity has landed a lot of people to marry to delay like if you ask them what is the problem they'll tell you that mm, they are not ready they're not ready with the responsibilities that come with marriage and all that and some people are so so attached to their mom that they see another woman as a rival so my take on this is that if you are a single lady waiting for a guy that's immature like no matter how ready you are you can never be ready for somebody that's not mature enough to settle down so better check yourself like this delay now that my experience is it because the guy is not is not financially buoyant or just be simply because the guy is immature so check yourself to know the whatsapp group you fall okay another reason why people experience marital delay is lack of boldness you see some guys here eh, like funny enough this is mostly with guys that are handsome the one you feel that okay they are handsome when they talk to girls they will be tripping like it will sweep them off their feet ah ah brother cannot talk he's like shyness have finished him he cannot even stand and said okay let me go and wait woman mm -mm. before you know it you get married to another person and they will not be caring that you break their hand meanwhile they do not tell you anything no lack of boldness have made a lot of people to be delayed unnecessarily so if you find yourself in that group make sure that you're working on yourself okay because shyness isn't kind to do you any good okay? Most men find it difficult though. I don't know why they find it difficult to even propose to a lady. Maybe because they are scared like, mm, the girl will reject them. Fear of the unknown, fear of rejection. Or God, the worst thing that can happen is the lady will tell you, mm -mm, I don't want you, I don't like you. And you move on to the next available boat. Don't stay there and be thinking and be wallowing and be saying, ah, I'm, fair, I'm, I'm scared of rejection. What if I tell her and she did not accept me? Hey, if you tell her and she did not accept you, move on to another person, okay? Time and time, wait for nobody, okay? Make sure that the delay you are experiencing, you are not the one that is imposing it on yourself. That is what I want to tell you guys. Now, another one is health problem. A lot of many beautiful faces you are seeing out there, some of them are having health challenges that will not allow them to settle down and do it on time. Then, for instance, somebody that is epileptic, and it's not everybody that want to settle down with them. I know somebody that turned down a proposal because she find out that the guy he want to settle down with is asthmatic. She was like, mm -mm, I can't deal with this one, okay? Like, a lot of people out there are not getting married on time because of one health challenge or the other. What my take on this is still boils down to looking up to God. If you're incapacitated in any way, don't, don't take it that this is the end of life. Some people will see you and uh, the way you are still fall in love with you. Somebody that cannot even walk, like the person is happily married. You guys already know, okay? So if you find yourself in this category, there is nothing God cannot do. Look up to God for divine intervention, okay? This thing I'm sharing is from my own observation. If you have any other things that you feel that okay these are the things that are causing delay in marriage let me know as usual in the comment section okay i love reading your comments and i love learning from them thank you guys for your time thank you guys for watching okay and i'm sure we'll see you again in my next video okay